In this problem, we want to determine whether each relation is a function, and then give the domain and range for each relation. So we got the uh, 2, 3. Then we got uh, 4, 8. And we got 5, 9. So I can write that a little bit better. There we go. Okay, now first to determine it's a function. First, you look at your x values. If they don't repeat, it's a function. So I got 2, 4, 5. They don't repeat, so this is a function. So the first part is very simple. Now, domain. Well, all of it's pretty simple. Uh, domain is your x values. So I'm going to write down my x values from smallest to largest, not repeating any. So I got 2, comma, 4, comma, 5. Now your range is your y values, and I'll write them down from smallest to largest, not repeating any. So I got 3, 8, 9. And those are our answers to that problem.